congrats to the Clay People Ceramic Studios, Carol and Jesse for winning the prize. I just ship them so let us know when you received it. Thanks to Books actually for taking care of the post stage. And here is some interesting news. My cartoon appeared on Channel 8 two nights ago. This sketch is by Ad Kipopo and she made this sketch while watching one of my YouTube video episodes in her living room. Kipopo is currently taking part in circuit sketch break. Right, guys, I'm here at Green Dot inside Thai Labor Square. I love this place. Oh my goodness. Uh, come check out the bentos. Here. I see that this one feels as if I'm sketching on board a plane, like an in-flight meal for some reason. Okay, so we have mushrooms, broccoli, pumpkin, long beans, mushrooms, uh, bean curd, more mushrooms and brown rice. In other news, the circuit breaker has been extended to June 1st. Some of the measures have been tightened, for example, standalone FMB outlets like bubble tea stores, uh, coffee stands, they're all asked to shut down for the time being, meaning no bubble tea for me. Th interestingly, this is going to be the first time in history both Starbucks and McDonald's are virtually not in operation in Singapore. Barbers and hairdressers, they fall in the same category. They will cease to operate from now until 1st of June. You guys, Mum's Touch from South Korea is finally here at the Thai Labor area. That's why I decided to check it out. I did a lot of grocery shopping after and yes, you can see that the burger has squozen. So let's not focus on that and let's get to the sketch. I'm gonna try to make it look a little bit more pretty in the sketch. Hey guys, so my heart sank a little bit last night when I saw this clip by Mothership SG stating that laundromats will be closed and I wasn't prepared to pay $20 for a laundry service here in Singapore. Fortunately, a friend double checked and told me that only unmanned laundromats are allowed to operate. So I immediately headed down to the one closest to my studio to do my laundry. Whew. I'm having a Taiwanese maze soba, Nagoya style.
Hi guys, good morning. Elvin Mark here. It's the first day of Ramadan. To all those who are celebrating, have a good month of Ramadan. Go song So if you guys are interested to see what the inside of this looks like There's coconut shavings and there's gula malacca or cane sugar that was drizzled over it It's just a sweet cake So good And very sweet Alright guys, I'll be spending the rest of the afternoon laughing at my students, I mean marking my students' work. So until tomorrow guys, ciao ciao. Alright guys, how are we doing today? I was waiting all day for my new Circles prepaid SIM card just to let you guys know that I don't have broadband in my studio Oh no! So I rely heavily on my data So I had Starhub for a while and that wasn't enough So I got Grid and uh, that is also not enough So that's why I'm opting for the 100 gigabytes. Just to give you a rough idea, last night's video that I uploaded the circuit sketch break file is about 3 gigabytes to upload. Let's hope that this one works and that it can last me for at least a month. We're back at Green Dot and I'm gonna have that delicious looking signature laksa. So healthy looking right the food. Look at look at that. Hi guys, this is Day 20, Alvin March here. Welcome to the program. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm gonna have wonton noodles today. I'm gonna try something a little bit different from what I've been putting out. So watch on. This is Elvin Mark, welcome to the studio. We're gonna do something a little bit different today. Got a request to do a portrait and this comes all the way from the Netherlands all masters from from the Netherlands are whom I look up to so it's interesting that in requests to do portraits all the way from the Netherlands thank you for that so the story goes my client's father passed away last November and he's requesting for a portrait of his dad for his mom who misses him dearly. I was given two pictures to work with. Those were the only images that my client has and obviously I won't be able to work with a light model. So I'm gonna spend the next few days to work this one out. So stick around guys.
thing called the Gui Chap and it's just too messy to sketch. So I don't have enough plates or bowls to lay it out properly so I'll find something else to do. Hey guys, Elvin Mark here. Welcome to the studio. We're gonna do a quick still life since I messed up earlier on with the taking back of the new. This is my view of it right now. So let's do it guys. How about that guys? I know the colour isn't showing up all that well on this video but a lot of you guys on social media love to comment that my paintings look very realistic so much so you wanna just reach out and, and touch them Oof, which I definitely not recommend you do especially when it's wet but what I would suggest you guys do is this <laughs> so it becomes very 3d right yeah so that's it folks thank you so much whoa this is this is totally absurd what is going on here guys this is Elvin Mark until the next whoa <laughs> until the next video guys ciao ciao